Good morning, everybody. I my phone died last night, so I didn't get a chance to do the water signs. Um, message from the ex, so we'll do Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. One of the messages for the water signs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. What do they want them to know? And how do they feel about them? What are the messages from the exes for Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio? What do they want them to know? How do they feel about them? Don't turn it on again. I, not right now. What are the messages for the water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio? And what do they want them to know? Somebody wants to have a... So there's probably a fire sign for a Cancer. Um, person that things didn't move forward in the past. Right. Okay. Split this up. Okay, Cancer, you have. Fire sign or just someone in general who wants to have a, um, the king of wands is like really passionate. So I think like someone wants a passionate start with you, even though and things in the past didn't really move forward. Pisces, you have someone who wants to offer you, um, their cup of love, even though in the past they were... greedy, maybe all about themselves. And then Scorpio, you have someone who wants to have a like, you know, kind of like grow old together type of thing, even though in the past you're involved in a third party. Starting with Cancer, we have the lovers in reverse. So... You um, could be divorced from someone or this could be someone you broke up with because of and they're kind of like, they regret it. And they don't want to be left out in the cold by you. And they want things to be balanced um, in the, the relationship or maybe they, just to come to some type of compromise this time with your guys' relationship. Because in the past there was no leap of faith taken either by you or them. But they are at the reciprocity stage where it's an equal give and take. Or that's what they want, maybe. And um, they think that maybe you're mo having more than one choice. Or they just want things to be, um, like, equal. Because there were th some plans that didn't go as, like, go through last time. But they um, think that you are their wish come true. And they think that they could be really happy with you. Or they are really happy with you. Now that they have um, some... They needed some clarity in their life. They have clarity in their life now. And they can kind of see things a little bit better. But they're kind of in a difficult position because they're not sure if they should tell you how they feel or not. Because you're kind of being the queen of swords. You don't want to hear shit. And you're cutting out the bullshit. And they might be part of the bullshit. You never know. Because they caused some um, family trouble, maybe a broken marriage situation in the past. They want you to stay strong. And they might have been manipulative in the past. 
but they're still trying to come into your life and they want to be reliable and patient and hardworking and offer that to you to be a part of your life. <coughs> Even though things were really imbalanced in the past and there might have been some unfairness or um, dishonesty, there might have been some legal problems, they want to come home and be happy and um, maybe get married. But in the past they didn't know what they wanted, but now they do want a long-term investment with you or they, they think of you as a long-term investment. And they're kind of stuck right now. They aren't able to move on from you. They want to be this um, structure, authoritative figure. Even though in the past they were emotionally um, abusive and manipulative and unbalanced themselves, they are working on themselves because they know that there's some of the beha behavior needed to change. And they were had received some bad news or they just were um, kind of weak with how they came across or maybe um they didn't come they didn't say the right things to you they're really stuck in their head about it right now about you and they're kind of in isolation but they are thinking about you a lot okay pisces there is someone who wants a passionate new start with you could be a fire sign but they feel like there's other people. Maybe you have other people. Or maybe they feel like um, there's like some obstacles that need to be worked out before this can happen. Because they're really overthinking right now. And they're like trying to um, like work a lot to keep their mind off of you but they're also kind of jealous of whoever you're talking to now but I feel like they're trying to get their money right because they are still thinking about you a lot and like all the good times that you guys had and they want you to leave your situation or either or maybe they'll be leaving their situation because they still want to be with you they want to have a new start and recovery and they would like forgiveness for the shit that happened in the past because they still want to come in and offer you this passionate new start. And they know what they want. And they're going to be very clear about this with you. Um, and maybe they'll be sending you a message. Because they do, like, they kind of, like, figured out that maybe you're the one for them. Even though there was some heartbreak and loss and depression. Or maybe they still are depressed and heartbroken over this situation. You make them really happy. And maybe they were smothering and insecure in the past. They want to offer you this new start with them. And they want to be on the same level as you and work together with you. But they're afraid that you're not going to want to be with them anymore because you're not going to because they don't make you happy. But they want to offer this stable, you know, committed relationship um, or if you're already in a relationship, you know, they want to be on the next level. <coughs> but they feel like you think that you just wasted your time with them. Scorpio. The person that you're dealing with wants you to know that they're transitioning from something in their life. They're eliminating some things in their life right now. And that even though they're not really speaking their truth, they do see things they do know things and they're really lonely and they feel like they're just repeating the past mistakes over and over but they want they're resting and they're trying to recover and they want to heal from the things that they've been through in the past they have a lot of mixed feelings and they're feeling really defeated and like a big sense of loss without you in their life they definitely don't feel right without you guys together. I think they want things to be... They, they want a rebirth with you. They want, like, things to be even, like, unfair for both sides. Because they're going to be speaking their truth and, and um, they know what they want now. Or maybe they can see a little bit clearer about themselves and what they want in their life because they definitely want a new start with you 
so that you guys can move forward. But there might be some um, addictions going on in this situation. But they want you to know that they're working on themselves. And they want things to be balanced. And they really do feel loss and regret and grief. And they really feel abandoned without you in their life. And I think they're going to be telling you this. They're going to be speaking their truth. Because they feel like maybe they should just give up because you're going to move on. And they got caught up in some bullshit and they are trying to make things right with you. Because you guys are in a stalemate and neither one of you are really able to move forward right now. And they're really stressed out and in their head about all this. They have a lot going on in their life. Um, they want to offer you, but they feel like maybe it would be too immature of an offer for you. That maybe it wouldn't be enough for you to want to stay with them. But they know that you're a good parent and you're really understanding and empathetic and, and a bit, like emotionally balanced. Or maybe they want to be this in your life. Because they're unable to move on their life without you. So they want you to work together and they're really hopeful and they're waiting for you to kind of make a decision or maybe waiting to see if that if that's something you want to. Because they want um, to be victorious in the situation with you and they know all the things that you've done for them in their life. And they want to move forward in life with you even though there was some breakups and separations and, you know, arguments and stuff in the past. They're going to be sending you a really quick message because they want to, to renew this and they're trying to remain hopeful that things will, there will be a miracle in this situation because in the past there was either the way they talked or the way that they were when it comes to being scattered and impatient and impulsive. Maybe this was that person in the past and they, there were a lot of blocks in the way for them in life in general, but they want that to end. They want all the bad stuff to be over with in their life so that they can offer you this new cup of love. So I hope everyone is having a good morning. I think that's all I have. Have a good day.